Hello everybody, this is Standby Ranger, and as you can see, we are starting a very new adventure together with XCOM Enemy Within. Um, this will be the very first computer game that I'm recording, so um, the way I'm going to have this stuff set up is I'm going to play about maybe 15 minutes, you know, make sure my computer can handle it, um, upload that, that episode, and then continue on to the second episode, so on and so forth. Um, the way I, the reason why I'm doing that is because my computer it can play these games, but not to the point where I can constantly go on and on and on before it explodes. So yeah, this is just a safety measure, I guess. But um, we were playing a XCOM Enemy Within. Um, I love this game. I bought XCOM Enemy Unknown about a month ago, and then I beat it once because I was on normal and then um, I bought Enemy Within the day after Christmas so I, I'm i not done with this one I'm not, I haven't beat Enemy Within yet but I do have all the DLC and I'm about to beat it on my other playthrough but I wanted to start a new one so that way I could record it so yeah um I'm going to play on normal, I played on easy, I think I got the hang of it where I can, you know, play it pretty well on normal. Um, I was going to do Iron Man, so that way I'm not tempted to reload saves constantly and then bore the crap out of you guys, but um, I'm just going to just gonna go for it, bite my tongue, you know, make sure I don't mess anything up, because I don't like people dying on me, but that's something I can't really stop. I mean... I can't stop it, but if it happens, I guess it'll just happen. But, um, yeah. Those who play with the devil's toys. Pass for effect. Will be brought by degrees to wield the sword. Buckminster Fuller. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be quiet for these. For those who have not seen any gameplay for it at all, I will be quiet. Hey, by the way, if you guys hear creaking of a chair and then me falling on my ass and possibly breaking something, it's because I nearly broke my computer chair like 30 seconds before I started recording. So if you hear me physically hurting myself, that's what happened. Just to let you know. Supposed to be a Spanish accent, but in light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. Urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Good luck, Commander. XCOM. Pew! Enemy within. Oh, okay. All right. Um. I have played on North America and Africa, being as the easiest starts with the continent bonuses. Um, I think I'm gonna still do North America, because aircraft can get pretty expensive, so I, I think I'm gonna do that.
going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. Is this an all-women squad? We picked up a local broadcast indicating oh, alien cool. activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there Flight and eliminate the any hostiles. If I didn't already have that achievement. Launch mission. Yep, all female squad. All right, let's do this. Strike one. This is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Alien oh, found enemies. But, um, I guess. History. I mean, I'm in the term of strategy games. I'm kind of okay at them. I'm not like super awesome where I can like multitask and destroy enemies with my overwhelming army might but um I I guess I'm okay at them I mean I really like them they're one of my favorite games to play but um take a lot of time and patience and making sure that you're paying attention and sometimes I can mess that up but I, I still like them it's fun Running. I mean another reason I was trying I was gonna consider doing Iron Iron Man mode is because if I lose a soldier that I really like or a high level soldier I have the tendency to quit the game or reload a save because I don't know I don't want to lose like if I named a character after myself or one of my friends or they're the only reason I'm you know doing okay at the game I really just want to reload the save you know just to make sure I don't screw anything up but I'm just gonna refrain from doing that this time around so that way you guys don't get bored with what I'm doing yeah like the starting equipment for this game for your soldiers really sucks because they're super inaccurate and if you just forget not really forget if you don't really pay enough attention to just buy and upgrade your weapons and armory you're pretty much screwed so this is a game that you gotta put really time and attention into it which is fun I mean it hasn't stopped me from actually doing well with this game, but we it's, it's a little tough. That could be salvaged for our own development programs. Get this guy. Bam! Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna use her to grab the melt. Because the melt was a pretty cool addition into any within. I really liked it. I mean, you can make mech troopers and get augment your soldiers with uh, abilities that can help you along the way with the game. I mean, I really enjoy it. I still have a gun. For some reason... Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, for some reason, whenever our soldier panics, they always seem to do a lot better with firing at enemies and making sure they get hits. Which is weird. But, um... And I also learned, if I take out the guy that's controlling this one... They will both die, so let's see if that'll work. Uh, yes! I do it. Is that the end of the mission? Good work, awesome! Strike one. If I may, Commander, the All right. are on high alert. Teams Which one's successful? In we can begin Chiu Fu Hua, I, I, I'm not even going to attempt to say that. I don't want to... You know, be racist. Not racist, but, you know, mess something up. But, um, yeah. First push successful. I had recorded some gameplay of this earlier, but did not realize Fraps was not recording external audio, so this is the second time I'm doing this. It's not that bad though. I mean Ah, uh, yeah. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Hi, Bradford. Commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. With your My pixelated sweater. 
providing tactical support for our field operations, and keeping you briefed on the current situation. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Why, right, thank you. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Okay. I really like Our the way they do in dealing massive amounts of damage from afar. The uh, sufficient training. They're vulnerable and the abilities and stuff like that. Like, I like the tech trees. I like the choices. Um, I'm glad they put in. like it sounds, the support class you know, uh, provides that two new tangible new edge our squad classes. They make everyone around within. them better. Well, it's a lot more better of a um variety when you're putting your squads together for there missions. There are covered artifacts are being unloaded, and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Are you? Let's just. To the research labs. Oh, okay, let's go to the research. Let's get rid of these exclamation points. These Hello, notifications, Commander. and I guess that'll be My name is Dr. A, place, a good place to stop for the first labs. episode. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. We have already and I'll let these sort of cutscenes run for people who haven't watched it, with the or um, not watched Based on this, our but findings, people who have, um, haven't seen any gameplay or were wondering some new equipment for our what these uh, cutscenes were. With your approval, I don't know why, but we will begin you know. research immediately. Let's do. Usually, I start off with xenobiology, I agree. so I that can get the, seem to be the most pressing of story of my line options. going. And I go off to engineering. Uh, Commander, I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. God, they got these Speaking facilities which, up Dr. Valen quick. Just sent us some new I was considering, with I don't know how long we will begin ago, like the first alien uh, contact was. But considering the way it should be, these were built quickly and the soldiers were collected very quickly but um before I scan anything I think this will be a good place to stop um let me just check what soldiers I have in the barracks seriously do I have like a whole bunch of women I think this is just a barracks full of women and Jeff I think Jeff may be my only dude at least so far Holy crap. Huh. <laughs> That's a really weird... I've never had this happen before. Just all women. That's awesome. I guess. I, I don't know. Um, actually, want a couple dudes, because I plan on putting people I know in this game. You know, so that way I feel at least a little bit more of a personal attachment to them. But yeah. Anyway, um, good place to stop for the very first episode. So, thank you for watching. I will get on to the second video quickly and if you guys like it i'll continue to do this and maybe do longer playthroughs but as for now thank you for watching and peace out